handoff to get the try for Eagles. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is the game we've all been running against to really show their colours against one another. Uh, both teams are probably really looking forward to this game. Both teams playing in a sort of wonderful spirit right here at 48.7. So, Convent going wide, nice and early. Love one joining them in that. Love one getting right up there in their face. Kind of stuck on their try line here a little bit. The Jaguars are going to have to find their way out. Dangerous place to, uh, to be playing rugby. Needs to have an exit strategy of some sort. Someone's going to have to make a big play here. Still looking for that one player who's going to do it. Brutal stuff there from the Wipers. No way out, and they've got the turnover they're looking for. Going to step into over the try line. That's a try. That's the first try of the game. It really came from sustained defensive pressure from the Wipers. They just kept at them, kept at them, didn't give them any way out, suffocated them, and got the first try of the game. And the score stays at 5-0 to the Wipers over the Jaguars. Both, both sets of girls enjoying a chance to play a bit of local opposition. Something a little less intimidating than Kazakhstan or the Borneo Eagles. I think it's just a little bit more competitive than that. Once again, Jaguars must find a way off their own line. Love one are right up there, right up there in their face. Getting over the ball and getting the penalty again. So here's another opportunity. Straight up Main Street, straight, heading straight towards that try line. So close. And that's a try. That's the second try gone over, right under the black dot. Right under the posts. Very similar to the last try, almost exactly the same, just a couple of metres away. Sustained pressure, in your face defence, followed by penalty, a changeover, quick tap, try. And they kick it. The score is 12 0 to the Wipers, enjoying a bit of a day out now. If you take a look at them, it's just a matter of running in the gaps, she got dragged down, she kept going. She picked herself up again and kept going. Must have um, had a bit of a... So we'll get us underway again and this time the kick has got off, off, come off the side of the boot and it is the Jaguars who have got good position on the halfway line with the ball not coming off their line, so this is a, a welcome relief for them. And out they go very quickly, making good progress here. This is good work. 
And I just need to get over that ball, and they have, and they've got the penalty. Now go at it again. The Jaguars looking for their first try of the tournament. This is promising, but try line's not so far away. The defence has come, just got to her, and the referee has called it back. Oh. All so close, yet so far for the mighty Jaguars on the convent of Kota Kanabulu. Just up the road from here, a couple of hundred kilometres away. And it looked for all the money that they were onto something. And then the referee, we didn't see her, but she called it back. Forward pass. A little nod there, you can see they've got something up their sleeve here. What have they got? Girls from Love One. Bit of a move. All right, now it's just pace. Raw pace. Streaking down the field. Is there anyone? Can anyone keep up with her? Yes, they can. They come. Here comes the troops. Come across. It'll be too late. That's try. That's try time. Well done. So they got outside the defence. That was the plan, I guess. Strip them for numbers. Let the pace do the rest. Length of the field. That's one of the longest tries we've seen actually today. From about 10 metres out, offside from 10 metres off their own try line. Try time. Oh, and gets it over as well. Skims over the crossbar. So everything's coming up nice and rosy here this afternoon. The Lubbin Wipers here. It was just a one-on-one -on -one foot race. She put the ball under her arms, put her head back and let it go. The fence came across, I thought for a half a tick there she might have it. But this is good, good work from Lab One. Now watching the game between the Lab One Vipers and the Convent Jaguars from Kota Kinabalu. The unofficial score at halftime, Lab One Vipers 19 and the Convent Jaguars 0. Okay, here we go. Alright, here they go. Convent. Convent Jaguars. Almost scored up one end, unfortunately, can see to try another one. There's that fast moving love on defense, though, causing all kind of troppers, troubles. Oh, still coming through, but just a tad too quick. It's, it's good, enthusiastic defense, but they were offside. And a chance now. Oh, just she held that hand up, she dropped the ball. And I think the Wipers are going to take advantage of this. They certainly are so far. Being held up. On the ground. Pick and go. One pass. Two pass. That should be enough. It is. It's a try. It's try right next to the post. So from, from the turnover, just a loose carry. The Wipers have uh, punished the Jaguars with a try right next to the post. Looks like for a minute there. They're off and the referee to have a kick at goal. Twenty-six nil. This is a healthy, healthy half-time lead now for the Wipers. You see, there's a nice little double pump there. Just a nice offload again, and it was just stripping them for numbers right up the middle. Some defence to uh, confront her at the end, but it was too little, too late. And it's a good start here to the Wipers. Convent Jaguars, it must be said, has had a serious... And there it goes. So the Wipers will have first chance with the ball. And they're setting something up out here. There he goes. Dummy inside. Things have opened up nicely. But they still like that blind and they'll keep going that way. Good defence, over the top. The ball's hit the ground. The defence is still a couple of metres away, so see what they come up with. Pops it up. One more pass, that's nice work. That's very nice work. And this will result in another try, it will. She's pinned her ears back and she's gonna go for it. And she's gonna get there. Oh, look at the smile on her, <laughs> look at the smile on her face. She's thrilled to bits. Don't know if it happens very often, but she loves scoring a try this one. Handshakes all around. That was a lovely piece of work 
from um, the wipers, it must be said. Just uh, from one side to the field to the other, they used the full width and they just got some really nice offloads away. They kept the ball alive until they found their spare player and eventually it got there. They got what they wanted. Let's take a look. Now this is just the end of it and you can see the big smile on her face. Oh yes, all the Christmases have come at once. She loves it and who doesn't love scoring a try? And you can see the, the, uh, the crowd building up nicely as we come to the climax of this tournament. Friends and family of the players as well as the local Sandakanians, I think that's what you would call them. People, citizens of Sandakan, all here enjoying a wonderful return of the Borneo Sevens, the greenest Sevens in the world. And LeBron get another chance, but they've got to take their tap on the mark. Here we go. So the ball hits the ground, it's not a big problem until the defence gets there, but they still get the ball away. They could have them for numbers again, but the defence is good on this occasion. Dropping the ball back. Some counter-rucking going on. There's a nice blind side. Will it work? More good defence. Nice offload off the ground. More offloading. They're very good at this loved one when they get going. They uh, support each other very well and they keep the ball alive. Now you look over there, there's a whole heap of acreage for, for the wipers if they can use it. They drop the ball out there. She's eyeing it off, she's going for it. There's defence there, they slam her to the ground. Must be very close to that touch line, but the referee is not happy with that slamming. It did look a little bit aggressive. And they will walk over the try line. So that was probably the simplest try we've seen throughout the whole tournament, but it came off the back of some great running rugby. And again, Labuan just keep the ball alive. They just keep passing the ball, keep passing the ball until they see what they like and they get there. So well done to them. And in the end, poor old uh, Jaguars just run off their feet. It's been a big tournament for them. And that means a wall short. 38 to nil. The Jaguars, they've got three minutes to see if they can get a try. Their first score of the tournament. It's been a tough one, it's been a rough one. For those interested, the, co the, Covenant, uh, the Covenant School is a school of just 700 girls, or girls Catholic school in Kota Kanabulu, the capital of Sabah. And so they're not like they get a huge heap of players to call upon, and yet they are certainly playing with a great deal of courage here today as they have all weekend. Going back to get the ball, they felt like they've been doing this the whole game. Trying to use it. There's something going on here. Oh, one more pass. Yep, here we go. Now, have we got some speed to burn? We've got some cover defence, but... And so she's got to try to recycle this ball. And uh, she's got the penalty. Come on, people, let's cheer for a Jaguars try. Number 13, on the line. Let's try, let's cheer for a Jaguars try. I don't, I don't know if the Wipers want one, but goodness me, they've, they've worked hard this whole, whole weekend. Going forward, they're still going forward. Good strength, good pers persistence. And there's a gap right up the middle and off she goes. Is there anyone in front of her? No, I don't think there is. <laughs> she's all ankles and knees and arms and legs and she's gonna get there. Yeah, she's done it. And the crowd goes crazy. The first try of the tournament for the Jaguars is scored. And I, I'm, I'm really hoping that's just tears of joy because my goodness, this is a joyful moment. Or is that, are they tears of pain? The medic's coming out to see which one it is. Oh, it's a, a little bit of pain. <laughs> it's, a, it's a little pain. What a trooper. What a trooper. She spotted the gap. She saw it in front of her and she just went for it. And she did not stop until she crossed that line. She planted that ball on the ground. Well done to the Convent Jaguars for getting your first try of the tournament. 
think I can say. Honestly, it's lifted the stadium. Oh, and they almost got the kick to boot. It's almost got the kick to boot. Much thanks goes out to everyone. So let's take a look at this again. Put this in the highlight reel. There she goes. I don't think there's anyone within 100 miles of her, but it <laughs> didn't matter. She wasn't going to let anything stop her. Oh, that's precious. That's as much rugby as anything else you'll see this weekend, people. Just giving it a red-hot go against all the circumstances, trying your heart to the very end. Oh, it warms the heart, doesn't it? The Lama, they want to see if they can have the final say in this game. The Wipers have had a good, a good tournament as well. They've played well, and they're really charging home with what will be a very solid victory indeed. And they're coming in, they're looking for support, they're looking to offload. They've been very good at that the whole game. Will they finish with a try? Trying to shake off some, oh, some very aggressive Jaguar defence. I hope everyone's right there. And it was a high tackle. And uh, once again, full respect there goes to the Jaguars for throwing their body on the line, even with the score line as it is at this late stage of their tournament. Cross inside, the try line's just there. Another pop inside, and that's a try. And they will finish on top. They will finish with a try. I believe I heard the siren go off. Just a nice couple of offloads there. And the Wipers will finish their tournament with a try. Unless I didn't hear the siren go off. waved away. And that will end proceedings for these two brave local teams. Labuan, they have the Labuan Wipers, they scored a, a lot of tries here in the last game, they'll take that home with them. But I think for the Covenant Jaguars, that try at the end will mean a whole lot more. Less is more as they say.